Welcome everybody to the 2022 World Cup when the Sport City Stadium in Doha, Qatar or the final or the final. This one will be between, be between two top 10 teams coming in the world rankings coming into the World Cup in Croatia number 9 and Brazil the number 2 team in the world. Croatia is coming off a 4-2 win over Ireland in the round of 16 while Brazil barely escaped against Tanzania they had to go to a shootout penalty shootout which they won 10 to 9 Ederson was the hero there saved the 10th penalty Tanzanian penalty then stepped up and put the 10th Brazilian penalty home so I think Brazil's gonna wanna not have that happen again I don't think they're gonna wanna go to penalties but We'll see how they do against a very, very tough Croatian side. Russia is undefeated so far. His all teams are actually undefeated. Uh, the only blemish is uh, Croatia with the 1 1 draw against Australia in group play, and Brazil had a 1 1 draw with Jamaica. So let's take a look at the starting lineups for both teams. Croatia will come out in a 4 2 3 1 formation with Ivakovic and goal. Moro partnering Gidvai in the center of defense. Ordeal on the left. Or Slyko on the right. Deepest midfield there is Brozovic. Uh, Brozovic and Kovacic the captain. Across the attacking midfield on the left of Marin. In the middle of Vlasic and Prokalo on the right. Up top, Kramaric will start. March is a second in the tournament in goals with four for Brazil oh we are also missing for Croatia we're missing Benkovic who uh, picked up a straight red card in the match against Ireland so not only did Ireland not only did Croatia come back and win that they also won that down 10 men for the majority of the match so Croatia may be a little bit tired coming in but they may also be riding some momentum for Brazil coming out in a 4-2-3-1 formation as well. Ederson, as we said, talked about the hero of the round of 16. He'll start in goal. Alexandro who picked up a knock in that match as well. So we'll start off as the left back. Gabriel will partner uh, Fabinho in the center of defense with Danilo on the right. But there's Henrique and Arthur will be the deepest midfielders with the attacking midfield being the captain Neymar on the left. Lip Coutinho in the middle and David Neres on the right. Lone striker for Roberto Firmino. As they head down to the pitch for the opening kick. Brazil in their traditional yellow and blue. Croatia in their checkerboard red and white shorts. Brazil will start off with the ball going left to right across your screen. Croatia with some early pressure on the Brazilians. Arthur picking up an early yellow card, as well as Danilo. Not even 10 minutes in, and already a couple of yellow cards. Bardiolo pick up yellow cards, well as that. Oh, what a wonderful free kick by Neymar. Swung in, Alex Alexandro comes in, charging in, and follows that home. And Brazil will take an early 1 0 lead. We're not even 10 minutes in, and Brazil are up 1 0. Let's take a look at this free kick again. Well struck. Alexandro crashes in unmarked while he's at home. 1 0 Brazil. They are def desperately trying to avoid penalty shootout once again. Alexandro's re kick is straight to the Croatians. But they're going to have to build from the back. Rikovic will look long. For Vlasic, but tend it out. I don't know if pick it up. This left footed shot is wild, well wide. Ederson looking for Neymar. Head down to Alexandro. Arthur. Neymar. All the way across to Danilo. 
Finding Philippe Coutinho, but that's a pretty tame shot at Levakovic. Fabinho. Arthur, back to Fabinho. Good find Tanilo and a lot of space on the right. Cross for Neymar. Neymar scores! And Brazil will go up 2 0. This is a good, powerful header. It's in that back where it came from. After a wonderful cross by Danilo. 2 0 Brazil. Danilo was in a lot of space. Finally closed down, but he enough time to get that uh, get that cross off as for Slyko misses the header. Neymar makes him pay. Twenty five minutes in now. Ricalo has picked up a yellow card. Do the creations have an answer? Goodbye. The Brozovic. Myron. And some space on the left. Cuts inside. Shots blocked. Mario. The shot. Oh, good save by Ederson. Mario was one of the goal scorers in the round of 16 as Ricardo takes the corner. Dave Henrique will clear that away. How much it will pick up a card. Ederson gives that away to Myron on the left. Cuts inside. It's right foot shot. Ooh, hits the post. The march. Could not quite get to the rebound. And that's going to fall to Ederson. That was a wonderful shot by Myron on the, on the left. Hits the post. Real opportunity for Croatia. Here it comes again, Myron. Right footed shot, saved by Ederson. He's been very lively. Antonio Myron has picked up a yellow card as well. Continued on the left, finding Matias Enrique. Waits, fires. The coach picks the save, but that will go up for a corner. I don't know if is, but he was waiting for. We finally took, got rid of it as Neymar swings in the corner. Message. It's Bricalo. Bricalo going to try and counter. I have numbers, but he does cut inside. It's going to find. Oh, Alexandro with a good tackle. For Slyko comes forward as well. Cross. Then we'll head to clear. David Neres will finish up the clearance there. Fabinho with the yellow card. Ricalo finds Guardiola. Back to Ricalo. Guardiola. Ricalo again. Rizovic. Lasic. Lasic scores! Right before the half. Powerful shot. Anderson cannot handle it. And Croatia pull one back. See Bricalo. The Brozovic. Brozovic finds Lasic. He's not closed down. Fires a powerful shot that Anderson cannot keep out. Coutinho now. Two minutes of stoppage time. But Coutinho swings one in. A curling shot from 25 yards out. And Coutinho scores the reserve to uh, get Brazil another two goal lead. What a wonderful free kick. Steps up, swings it in. Livakovic is unable to get there. And Brazil are back up two, uh, back up two goals just before half. Take a look at the halftime stats here. Croatia, 11 shots, 4 on target. 1 goal. Brazil, 6 shots, 5 on target. And holding a 54 46%. Possession advantage. Brazil does seem to have their shooting boots on. They're getting a lot of shots on target. 
As we look at the type of performers here, Olasic for Croatia with the goal. We continue with that wonderful free kick before half. Uh, struggling to perform. Arn has been called out as bad, even though he's been really, really involved, I guess, is because of his shooting. Uh, our statisticians do not quite like what they've seen, but he's been very lively. And Fabinho for Brazil. They go down to the pitch for the second half. Perisic will come on for Myron. As Croatia starts off with the ball in the second half. It looked like they were going to take the momentum going in. Scoring in the 43rd minute. But uh, Philippe Coutinho's stoppage time goal really put a, an end to that. It's crucial with what a corner there. Neymar putting in some defensive work. Bacalo brings it in. Hit five. Down to Moro. Oh, blocked out. As Kamarch is offside. Definitely creating some opportunities there as David Nares picks up a yellow card. Arthur. Danilo. And I will to get through. Go try again. Heading inside. Finds Philippe Coutinho. His left foot shot is well wide. March will come on for Kermarch. Prize substitution. March has four goals. We would think they would want him on the pitch. Mercalo getting into the area. Oh, shot is well wide. Did good work there, but in the end, the shot is just not good enough. As Brazil have a throw in down the left. Neymar. Dias Henrique. Gabriel. Flip that all the way back to Ederson. Ederson again. It's time Perisic is in the way. Here comes Velasic. Attack by Fabinho, but Brozovic will pick it up. Looking for March. Velasic. The shot's blocked out. Yeah, really closed them down this time. And Croatia have another corner. We're into the 60th minute. All the swings in there. Brozovic, this header is over the bar. Really powerful header, but cannot keep it down. Counter upon 70 minutes played. Well, Revkovic will come on. Gabriel Jesus and Everton will come on. Speaking of Everton, gets it up to Gabriel Jesus as Brazil try to counter. Looking for Arthur. Arthur shot straight at Levkovic. Three quarters of the match played. Still 3 1 Brazil. And Bruno Guimarães will come on for Arthur. David Neres swings it in. Water of Kovic heads that clear. But here comes David Neres again. Right on the corner. Got about two minutes to go. David Neres going to try and swing this in. I was looking for Gabriel Jesus, but that falls all, gets all the way through to Fabinho. But for Fabinho's left foot shot is well over. Croatia have about five minutes and some stoppage time to try and claw back two goals. And it's certainly possible. We've seen it uh, in the quarterfinals already. As David Ayres comes forward, his shot's blocked. Good turn, looking for Everton. Everton shot. Oh, just misses on the volley. It was floated up to him, and Everton just tried to steer it 
to the far post and just missed as Croatia will have a throw in down the right now. Lasic over to Bracalo. Cross the block down for a corner. Corner's head clear. Bracalo again. Brozovic. Back down for the header. Missed the far post by just inches. So yeah, three minutes of stoppage time. Brozovic picking a meal card. Not much time left. Goes Perisic. Tackled away. Great work by Roberto Firmino. Number 10. Hiding David Neres. Loading it up to the back post. Number 10. Oh. Good save by Levakovic. And it looks like it's going to be a corner for Brazil. Not much time left to. Will not be in a hurry, I don't think, to take this. David Nair swings it in. David Kovic will claim that. And I think time has run out for Croatia. They have about 30 seconds to score two goals. I've seen crazier things, maybe. But I don't think it's going to happen here. It's Gabriel Jesus coming forward now. Ardiel makes a great tackle. But, wow, look at that. There was no one ahead of the midway line there for Croatia. And Perisic had to turn all the way back. I imagine the final whistle is going to be blown any second now. It's Bracalo. This is that header. And there it is. There's the final whistle. Brazil is going to advance to the quarter or to the semifinal. But they will face Poland. Let's take a look at the full time stats here. Croatia 16 shots, 5 on target. But of those shots, only created one half chance. Brazil 16 shots, 9 on target. They created one click on opportunity and one half chance. And just edged the possession 51% to 49%. Brazil really did outplay the Croatians, however. Our player of the match is going to be Philippe Coutinho with the goal, the wonderful free kick. Also got a goal from Neymar, played very well. And Alexandro, who had the opener, played well. Danilo with an assist. David Nair has played well. Uh, some disappointment here for Gabriel Jesus, Everton, and Roberto Firmino, and Matias Enrique. They were just okay. But when we look at the Croatians, we see a lot more problems. Nikola Vlasic played well. He's really the only one to play well. He scored a goal. Uh, Brozovic had an assist, but other than that, pretty anonymous. Let's look at some of the problems here. Perisic didn't do too much. March didn't really do anything. Kermarch up top didn't really do anything. Uh, Antonio Martin has been called out as poor. Very poor. Even though he was very lively in the first half. And that's really the difference. They just, besides Vlasic, there was just no good performances out of the Croatians. And that really hurt them. So this one's going to end. 3 1 win to Brazil. Brazil will move on to the semifinal.